guys, this is Nick from DV Reviews, and I'm here with Chris. And today we're going to be doing a uh, a spec and hardware, along with a speed test comparison of the MacBook Pro 13 inch against the MacBook 13 inch. And um, so yeah, let's begin. All right. So first on the MacBook Pro 13 inch, you have in order your MagSafe, MagSafe charging. That's how you charge it. Your Ethernet. Firewire 800, your mini display port, two USB ports, an SD card slot, and your audio out port. On the MacBook 13 inch, you have your MagSafe port, your Ethernet cable port, sorry, your two USBs, mini display port, audio in, audio out, and that right there is the uh, security slot. On both the MacBook Pro and the MacBook, you have this button right here, which shows you how much battery life you have left. On the front right-hand side of the, both the 13-inch MacBook and MacBook Pro, you have your sleep indicator light and your infrared sensor. On the right side of the MacBook Pro and the MacBook 13-inch, you have your CD DVD drive your CD DVD drive over here and on the MacBook Pro your security slot is right next to that. Now on the back sides this is the MacBook Pro 13 inch and the MacBook 13 inch on the MacBook Pro the uh, battery is completely sealed and on the MacBook 13 inch the battery comes out like that revealing the hard drive and the battery and now we're going to show what it's like when you restart and then reboot them up so if you can go to that I'll click the power button on both and then go to restart and click it. Hold on you guys, one sec. Sorry. I have my timer right here. So you can see there will be no splicing and I'll start the timer right after I click it. Ready, set. And they're off. Now the MacBook looks like it shut off sooner, but the MacBook Pro looks like it just started a little bit faster. The MacBook Pro already has the Apple showing and the MacBook just showed it. Already 20 seconds into the restarting. And if you can see, the MacBook Pro screen even looks brighter from this comparison. Wow. And MacBook wow. just started up quicker. And the MacBook started up quicker than the MacBook Pro. Wow. All right, now we're going to do a simple speed test on an application. We're going to open up Safari at the exact same time. And we are both connected to the same Wi-Fi. So it's completely even. And uh, yeah, let's begin. And that was pretty close. pretty close, but I think the MacBook Pro prevailed in We're going to try another speed test on the application GarageBand. I am running iPhone 9, but I really do not think that's going to be a, a, a real big difference in how fast they open. So, Chris, if you can open Once them. again, the MacBook Pro on this side is running iPhone 9. This is the MacBook. I'm running GarageBand. Oh, wait for this one. MacBooks look... Wow. wow. Do that again. I, I seriously think that might have been even more debatable than when we restarted it. Make and sure both are quit. Guys. They both quit. Alright. And... Ready? Three, two, one. That was the same exact time. Now, that was pretty close. Leading me to believe, is the MacBook Pro's processor really that much faster than the MacBook's? Because... I don't see much of a speed difference when opening up applications. Alright, we're going to try um, both MacBooks loading New York Times web page. Wow, and the MacBook Pro is done and that, the MacBook just finished. Alright, the MacBook Pro finished about a second or two before the MacBook Pro. I mean the MacBook, I'm sorry. Now, these are both the lowest end MacBook Pro 13 inch that you could buy and the MacBook 13 inch that you could buy. Um, when Nick bought this, it was 
$1,200 and when I bought this it was $1,300. Again, both the lowest end model. Now on the MacBook Pro, the illuminated keyboard comes standard, even on the lowest end. And unlike the MacBook, where on mine I have the lowest end and there is no buttons, it's just blank. If I had bought the MacBook $1,500 version, I would have got the illuminated keyboard. Well, that is it for this review of the MacBook Pro versus the MacBook. Um, hope you enjoyed. Please subscribe and make sure to follow us on Twitter. Thanks for watching.